that going for us. That's Hello, I'm Jonathan Ellsworth. I'm Jonathan Ellsworth, and this is my Telemark Masterclass. Shakespeare, so to be things. or not to be, that yeah. is the question. Hello, my name is Jonathan Ellsworth, and this is my Telemark Masterclass. <laughs> I'm really worried about jinxing, mostly myself. I don't care as much about jinxing you. <laughs> Thanks. But uh, yeah, I, I, I think I am expecting to just get down to be maybe not that hard, but the idea that we're gonna look like remotely good by the end of this day, no I'm doubtful. <laughs> Are you ready? No. <laughs> I'm going violent. to go violently. There's like no support. This is like a. You'll 40. have a whole ski in front of you though. Yeah. And they All don't. Right. Those bindings don't just and like. The they're not like tech toes where they're pivoting freely. There's See, a spring. See, that's a bit of the qu thing I'm still curious to figure out here. All right, review of the boots. As comfortable as my slippers. You do. Balloon. Kristen, is this where you should tell us that there's a left and a right? Kristen's claiming there's a left and a right binding, and I don't know if she's lying to us. I think she's lying to us. You gotta find where it attaches to your boot. Ah. You gotta go tell her up. There you go. Now you're up. Are you in? I think so. <laughs> we'll find out when I try and turn, I guess. <laughs> yeah. You gotta like get into it. This is Joey. Joey's on the Western Freeride team. He's a sick tele skier. He is just the person I want to run into at this moment. Yeah. What do I, need to know? I think you gotta you gotta, you gotta weight the feet evenly. You know. Weight it evenly. Yeah. Um. Okay. You know, upper body, torso facing downhill. Torso downhill. Uh -huh. Okay. You're making pole plants. I got the pole. I even got bamboo poles for it. I feel like they go well with the tele setup. That sounds about right. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Do they got it? I think so. All right. Does the pizza wedge work? All right, we've successfully gotten on our first tele chairlift. Now, does anybody know if you can like hockey stop on tele skis? Or if someone falls right in front of us, what should we be doing? Just Run pray for him. them? What do you think? I think you just lean back and hopefully everyone goes straight. It's mastered. Are you all in ski mode? Yeah. Yes. I have no idea. <laughs> I think ski mode. Yeah, you're My front ski is in a permanent state of pizza wet. So I think that's probably good. I feel like I'm basically just making one-legged turns down the hill, and that's working out fine, but I don't think that's really the point. We've received like 20 different tips, and I feel like I'm running through all of them in my head right now, <laughs> and trying to apply all of them at once. I think right now the biggest thing in my head is try and stay pretty balanced between skis, 
and kind of trying to achieve that 50-50 balance. Uh, I think we should see what happens. Very slow, flat light tele skiing. <laughs> down does the free ride world tour have a tele division Not anymore. why did you shut it down <laughs> yeah <laughs> Run, it's like figure something out and then figure realize ten other things I'm doing wrong. Oh, I'm leveling I'm leveling up the game right now. Guys. Have you ever tell you skied? I have not. I don't think I want to after that explain. <laughs> I thought I thought Luke was the lowest to the ground, which I heard his points, heard his points. But at the same time, I didn't see any edge pressure. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, no. <laughs> That's not a thing we do. That was awesome, guys. I had a great time watching that. Looking forward to getting in moguls because moguls like tell you where you need to be turning. And I feel like I could use that because right now I like don't know when I should be turning and not. I feel like I need some motivation to like actually make some turns, you know what I mean? <laughs> we need more crashing content. It's interesting looking at like a one and a half foot poppy lip as something that's intimidating. <laughs> this reminds me of like very first days skiing, but it's nice to be humbled once in a while. Your ego's been getting out of check lately, Luke. I think <laughs> I think this is good for you. Look at this. 
same after this. Good, way better than the first run. I don't know that I can really progress any further. <laughs> All right, how'd it go out there? Went well, I think. <laughs> yeah, it went great at times and terrible at others. But all around, I think it was fun and educational at the very least. So, yeah, I enjoyed it. Enjoyed myself. And I need people to know that I'm a telly skier now. I will say, in one day, we got more contradictory tips on what to do than anything I've ever tried to do in my life. Well, we wouldn't have done this whole video if it weren't for everyone who listen to and reviews gear 30 so thank you for that uh you all made this day happen we appreciate all of the support and the listening to and the reviewing and rating of gear 30 um thanks maybe uh and as you know next up which i think we're gonna shoot this spring is our snowblade video and then we got snowboard videos coming after that, if you people want them. So if you do, keep listening to Gear 30. Give us a rating and review if you like the show. And we'll keep doing things we're very bad at. Thanks.